So right now the dough is at its peak. So the yeast has risen, it's proofed is what we call it. And um, this is the time that it needs to be cooked. And so, like I said earlier, people were talking about, oh, can I have a fresh waffle? They want to watch me cook it. And if they come at the right time, they can watch. <laughs> but I can't leave the dough sitting to wait till people walk up um, because it's just ready when it's ready and it's perfect now. And so what we do is we cook them all off. Um, and then as people order them, we reheat them in the same waffle iron and you never know the difference. It's just, you know, people hear waffle and they don't really understand the kind of product that they're getting from us. <laughs> it's different than what we pour syrup on. We didn't even actually have syrup in the cart for the first year or so. <laughs> Hi there. How are you doing? Good, how are you? Good. So what do you want, honey? The chocolate. So the... one Belgian chocolate okay. and then one original. Okay. All right. It'll be 625. Perfect. It'll be just a minute. Okay, thank you. Uh-huh. So people are very animate though. So the pearl sugar we actually knead into the dough and the dough is a brioche dough which is very buttery. So it has, there's there's two and a half pounds of butter in one of our batches of waffle dough. It has a ton of butter, the sugar is kneaded into the dough um, and it's, it's really a baked treat. And people then still in America say, Oh, where's the syrup? Well, these are different. Why don't you try a bite and try it without the syrup because we've really taken care of the sugar for you. <laughs> but there's some diehards that still want syrup on them, and so I finally gave in. Mike said, you got to stop, <laughs> stop telling people if they want their syrup, give them their syrup. But I really don't think they need it. So by the end of the day, we're completely coated in sugar and this vanilla smell that comes off the waffles, which is not a bad thing at all. But when I go to the bank or just about anywhere, people, I, I, at first it kind of threw me off because people would say, what's that smell? And I'd think, oh man, what is it? And then they're looking for the smell. It was me. <laughs> I smelled like waffles walking into the bank. And then people would walk up and say, can I just smell you? <laughs> It was a little weird, but that's our major marketing uh, plan with this business is we just come down here and start cooking waffles and people walk up to the window. This is where that smell is coming from. So. I'm, I think I'm immune to it though. I don't smell it so much, and so everybody else kind of gets the, um, everybody else smells it and lets me know, I guess. 